And welcome back to Space Engineers. Hi. Uh, as you saw last night on the stream, I got a little bit done. Let's bring my UI back up and switch to first person. So we've got the six cargo containers ready for being able to be dropped. We do need to renumber them. I haven't done that yet. So they will have individual numbers. We got a little bit of the uh, basic skeleton going down to the back of the ship laid out. Got our two big engine pods. Now I was thinking about this last night. I know, scary thought. I think we might want to make this four engines at the back. What I'm going to do is, first things first, we're going to change the way it's held in place so that I can copy it. As long as I don't bounce it, it should be heavy enough now. So we'll take out that block and that block and that block and that block now we should be able to copy and paste it and may as well get rid of this copy the whole thing bring it over here that's still going to be the main build one. No, in fact, this is going to be the main build one because it's out of the way a little bit. So we'll just chop this up. Uh, I don't know. Do we leave that in there in between? I'm going to like it, but at the same time, no. We chop this off. Take the bits off the back of it for now. And just take those corners off for now. That will mean it's ready to be pasted on as I wish. Need to give ourselves a center line over here. Go on to the mirrored mode. Yeah, if we copy from there, let me just stretch it out a little bit. There we go. That looks about the right place. And we have got mirrored mode on, but it's going to be a pest. That's that's okay. We could deal with these little issues. Open it with copy and paste it on both sides with the mirrored mode, but we can always just copy another one. Same again. That sounds a bit better lined up. Yeah, that looks like a nice beefy back end of a ship. So we will get the plumbing in. Yeah, do we still have? Uh, yes, we do still have an oxygen generator on our hopper. There. In fact, what I might do is take that one out. That will give us more than enough oxygen generation for this ship. Uh, what am I looking for? Put this if I can bear junction. There we go. Okay, we can tidy up these back ends in a 
second. How's that look? That looks nice. Get that out of the way. Oh, that's a point. Let's just make sure. Yep, my whole window is here this time. We're doing things right. looked really nice or is it's nice it does kind of change what I was planning with the ship we may go with more drop cargo it's gonna be a shorter ship now seeing as it's so much wider and we want to go to there and to there and give us a uh, heavy inverted corners There, and there, ah, we took it, that's okay, sometimes you could really wish for the lighting to be a little bit different, there we go, now we need a normal heavy block, thank you, And then just a normal corner on here. And just for now, in case I decide to make changes at the end, which I have had some ideas just now, like literally just this second. This could be a ship. Yeah, if we're going for that long, we may want to make it a little bit shorter. That, that wide, rather. So what we are going to do... ...is... I've already got what I want on here. Which one was it on? There it is. F6... We want some hydrogen tanks. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's for small ships. And that's for small ships. We don't want small ships, we want large ships. Grab that. There we go. But before that, we want to put that there, that there, excuse me, and we can put some hydrogen tanks in, yeah that works, and what we could do then is we can take out these reactors, Shorten the ship up a little bit. Still needs to belly bulge down unless we can adjust these up a little bit more, but I don't really want to do that because we still need to make an access way. We'll see we'll see what we can do. So First things first, let's put our generators on. We do get more generation out of this. Because you couldn't do that with just the two. You think you need the four. It just just for prettiness. In fact now we'll leave it with the two for now, because I think two is overpowered with these ones. But we'll see what we need. We've always got space to add more, so we'll get rid of this. I'm going to block this in. Uh, back to the heavies. Do 
do do do do. slightly wider I could do some s extra little side thrusters because how wide it is these are not going to be in the right place anymore mm. okay let's pull those back out again for a second because I think those side thrusters need to go there uh, where have my hydrogen thrusters gone? Yeah, let's just stick them on a spare one. Uh, let's just pull all the thrusters down actually. This will be one large flat. Have some of those as well. Have all the thrusters. May as well. Don't need atmospherics because if this thing is going down, it's going down on hydrogen. We want the large one. Let's just see if this fits the way I think it will. And it will fit the way I think it will. Just a little exposed there. I really, really, I may have to look for a modded hydrogen thruster. I don't want much. I just want it to have a square block on the back. We'll leave that on for now. And that one's on as well. What we can do... We'll put some... basic thrusters up here. This line's going to be moved. Where for now, oh, we may as well take a conveyor block on here. Uh, well, that one, there we go. Let's just drag this forward a little bit. Oh, poop. Mistakes were made. Mistakes were fixed. One more in there. That'll give a nice little line of thrusters. And then what we can do is our generators can go on the back here, but we'll worry about that in a minute. I think I am going to pause there for a second and go have a quick look for some different hydrogen thrusters. I want to keep the same bell, but I just want the back end changed a bit. So I will be right back. Okay guys, welcome back. Uh, I had a dig around the workshop. I couldn't really find what I was looking for, which would have been something more like this, just with the square back. Um, but yeah, we've got these armoured thrusters. They'll do... I picked up two mods for the... I picked up the modular one as well, but I really don't like the look of that for this ship. Um, 
Come with the armoured thrusters. I did get the tiered armoured hydrogen thrusters, but I kind of just want to go with the basic one, basically the vanilla just with armour. Uh, which is these ones here. We get that one on the end, we'll just get rid of that. So we're going to be going with these for the ship. It means we can armour up the small ones as well. Armour up the larger ones on the side. I may as well replace these. Uh, part of me doesn't want to and the rest of me goes aesthetically it's going to look better with these armour thrusters in there let's have a quick look yeah that looks 10 times better well maybe not 10 times but it does look better One. Uh. Why is this not doing it on mirror mode? I hadn't turned mirror mode off, so it should have been working. There we go, that's those replaced. Now we'll replace these side thrusters. It's got the same connection points, it basically just looks like a big connector on the side. It's quite a nice bit of detailing though. Back last time I looked for armoured thrusters they were literally just plain. And I, yeah they do the job but they don't look very nice doing it. But with that being armoured we can actually do a little bit more in the way of detailing on the side of the ship here. So if we take this out, it still needs to be armoured, but it can look a little bit better. Not much better though, because it's dealing with... What I'd like to do is have that all the way along, but then that's in the way. Mm -hmm. well, we need to bring it back by one to make up for that. No, I know, I know what we'll do. Bring this back like this. This back like this. We'll quickly swap those back out to corner blocks and then we will have one of those and one of those save on this end and then we can use some catwalks or armor plates I'm going to catwalk for now, put that there. I'll just have a look, do I still have armour plating? No, we've only got the catwalks to work with, but that's fine. So we do that. Then what we can do is just... About to say we could just put a little thruster there, but no, I quite like the look of that. The fact that the hydrogen is glitching through is kind of cool as well. Unexpected, but kind of cool. Oh, in fact, I know what we can do just to give us a bit more strength. We go back to this. There we go. That looks weird and wonderful enough for me to live with. Gives it a little bit of depth, a little bit of character. Yeah, I quite like the back end of this ship so far. 
may end up extending these runnels, or whatever I'm going to call them. Let us replace these. Uh, where was that? On this one, it was on six, I think. Yes. I haven't decided what I'm doing for up thrust. It depends how much lower we go here. If it goes low enough, we'll have four of these large ones pointing down, I think. And if it doesn't go large enough, we'll have a big row of liquor ones, which I always think looks lucky, but touches life. Although for now, just just for maneuverabilities and symmetries. And we can't have the extra one there. That's annoying. But it's not annoying, but it's because that's an access walk. No, oh, that's okay, we can leave it. Ooh. They're very detailed. Again, I was expecting just a normal armor block with a thruster sticking out of it. That's kind of pretty. So we may as well, seeing as we're doing armored thrusters anyway. No, because I kind of want to stick. Do I want to stick with the Azimuth thrusters all over? Uh, I did have them there. Atmos. That's a large armored thruster. We'll have a small one as well. I'm not worried about the angled ones just now, although I may put some of the angled ones in here. They're going to be the Azimuth ones, because I just prefer the Azimuth ones. So they're too long. Uh, not they are too long. Um, they are the number too long. But they are too long. Uh, so quickly put that back. this level seems a perfect place to start bumping out the size of the ship for six and we want the blue where's the blue there it is one two three naming it Now for some reason my graphics have glitched since loading in that and yeah I'm only getting the light from certain directions but it should be okay. Now I think for upper dunes I'm gonna run a bit. Oh, that, that's the wrong one. We want the number two. We will just stretch a line across here. Up a 
around the bottom. Oh, we've used the white one instead of the blue. Silly kitty. Uh, take those back out again. Although in saying that, I'm kind of glad we've done the wrong one. I did the wrong one even. So I don't think I want that many. I want it more like that. The same, same top as bottom, although on the bottom because these are not needing the uh, oh which way we're in did I face those that way because these don't need to hide the hydrogen lines I can do a little bit better with them and have that central one and that one and that one Actually, just for the sake of maneuverability, we'll just put the extra one. No, the extra ones in, not the extra fucking twos in your silly game. That one, and same again up top. Seriously. Try that again, game. Try that again. So that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one. Yeah, that looks kind of nice. What we can do just temporarily, we'll just throw a couple of hydrogen thrusters on the front here. And it will stop it drifting, because we've now got every direction covered. We can even technically fly this to test it, except we have no gyros. Gyros would be a useful thing. But we'll finish blocking out these. Uh, we want the heavy armor blocks. Four more blocks. And we're going to... are going to bring them to here, you see the game. I think we will go with what I was thinking and continue the runnels down the engine bay. A bit awkward. If I've got the sizing wrong we can always change it. This one has to stay there. In fact, seeing as we can't do top and bottom. If we take those out we can continue this with a little bit of detail. We'll come back to that. Let's swap these out for some normal corners or slopes rather. look beastly enough what we might do is just to make up for the fact we had to take out some of the engines no because no no mm. I kind of want to make this all thrusters but that takes away from what I was going to do there to cover up that one. Ah, it's a little bit of detail. Oh, those are, right. those are the wrong engines. Um, yeah, those are completely the wrong engines. We want these ones. Uh, 
They're still azimuth, so they'll probably still work the same way. What are you doing, you silly computer? I'm blaming the computer for my own mistakes. Sue me. So that goes back there. Now, kind of need to keep this built up. So what we could do, yes, what we can do, in fact, not even just could, we can actually change move things around, we'll make sure everything's connected up first. One of those. It's some of those. some more armor blocks there. This needs to be changed slightly. So what we can do instead... What can we do instead? We'll go for double redundancy, that's what we can do instead. So we'll pop over to... I've uh, moved that off of there. Yeah, that will do. Run these along to there for now. And we take this out. And we put in some of these. Yeah, it's got a nice look to it. Might be able to do something a little bit better here. But I know we can do better than that. Just with vanilla parts we can do better than that. Uh, do we need that one or can it be moved? We do kind of need it there. Oh no, it can be moved. Oh, what was it? Uh, put that there, we can pull that one out. I just realised we've been flying all the way around when we had a shortcut. We do. Uh, we're going to need different blocks. Armor block. Armor blocks. There they are. We want these corners, and we want these corners. That's not a corner. That's not what I thought I was dragging. should have also done was mirrored top and bottom. So we take out these for now. And you're going to cheat ever so slightly and just block out the whole thing and then So, 
these come away. And these come away for now. Again here. No, no, no. One time I want to hit right click. Just to break up the monotony a little bit, we may end up putting some more side thrusters along here. Mm. Not for now. We'll, we'll see how she handles first, but that's always an option. again remember what I did yeah okay I know what I did now well I knew what I did anyway but I wanted to make sure that we bring that back as far as we need to uh, was it to there or was it one further it was to there and please excuse the idiot in the background unfortunately I live in an area of twats that's if you could hear him hopefully I've got my sound settings set so you can't So do as the last item on the list for today. Let's have a quick look at these. See how big they look powered and powered off. Yeah, they could work in right in these back corners. The perfect size as well. We take out these. to me. Just remembered that I want it mirrored mode. That and that and then if we can get to some kind of access panel. Turn them off for a second. Can I access through here? Nope. Can I access through here? I should be able to. Mistaken, they should be almost perfectly flat with the body. Yeah, we might want to just run some catwalks either side. But no, I could kind of want to just because you can see through here, just along that edge, but I don't know.
don't even know where that one landed. Let's go find it. I don't think it knows where it landed. But yeah, aesthetically, I kind of prefer it with the catwalks there. I hate placing the things though, they're awkward. Yeah, that kind of... That kind of works for me. I need them all the right way around, but apart from that... That works for me. Because it works with that pattern, sort of. Alright, and that will be it for this episode. We've done the engine pods at the back. Pretty much completed them. I'm not going to cover up the front of them because I haven't quite decided what to do with this area inside. Um, I'm probably going to sweep them in a bit because she is very wide. But we will get to that in the next episode. And thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you liked what you saw, hit a like. If you didn't, hit a dislike. Leave me a message either way and I will respond. I respond to all my comments. And I will see you again in the next time. Next time. Bye bye now.